Let's go, baby! Oh, no, you did not. Oh, she's going big spender with all of her meter there. What's up guys, my name is on Cage Games. Welcome back to another Injustice 2 Boot Camp episode. That is right, we are doing another Boot Camp episode for Injustice 2. I took a little break from doing the boot camp because I don't want to do too many boot camps and then forget previous characters. A lot of times, like I learn too many characters and then the earlier characters, I forget what to do with them. So, I'm trying to uh, master my craft before learning a new character. But, I felt like it's been a while and a lot of you guys are a fan of the boot camp. So, why not do another one? And my buddy, j Roar gave me a great idea for this boot camp for the month of October. So, let's go. You guys already know by the title and thumbnail. But, we're doing the first episode here. Which is, go through the battle simulator or the tower with this character. And see what we know off the bat. And, that character is... your boy... Scarecrow. You can see right now, I have no gear with this character. I'm a level 1 with him. I have not touched him once. I've always wanted to learn Scarecrow, but I just never had the time. And now we're doing the boot camp. It's October. This is the perfect time to learn Scarecrow. So if you guys are excited for another Injustice 2 boot camp episode, give the video a thumbs up and let's go through his tower on medium. Because that's what we do. Oh, think you're rehabilitated? I'm a work in progress. With an acute fear of regression. Begin. Okay, so if you guys are not familiar on how the boot camp works, it's pretty much I pick a character in the game and I try to learn the character uh, from noob to somewhat decent with the character. So I played the Flash early on in some of the earlier episodes. My Flash in the beginning sucked and now it doesn't suck as much. And uh, that's what I'm going to try to do with Scarecrow. First episode, usually, we uh, go through the tower and see what basic combos we know without even looking at his move list. Alright, this is like, we try to learn the character blind. So, don't expect any high combos, high damaging combos. This is just a work in progress, guy. We gotta start somewhere. Alright, two in combo, baby! The double uppercuts! Let's see, okay, we got that. I see a lot of, uh... Pros do that. It's a plus, I think. Oh, no, you did not, sir. My turn, pop. Okay. And I know there is a move that he does. Kind of like a scorpion's uh, chain grab thing, but no looking at the move list. That's for episode two for Scarecrow. Episode two is when we go into training and try to learn some sick combinations. But that's not this episode. This episode is what we know with the character right off the bat. Hey, we got Scarecrow legs. Let's go. Tell me, how is your son? You stay away from Connor. I'll visit him next. Dang. We go into Connor's house for trick-or-treating. You know what I'm saying? Oh, man. Dude, you don't talk about someone's family. That's like, that's a no-no, Scarecrow. But I'll let that slide because we're playing as him right now. So, we got the spin rooney chain. You can't get down on us. We got a little bit of... Ooh. I think you can do a back three after that. So, let me uh, try to get more meter here. Black Canar, not doing much right now. What's up? You know, I think about it. Because I took so long of a break from the boot camps, and now I'm bringing it back. This is kind of like season two, right? Oh, shoot. We're doing season two of the boot camps. Let's go, baby. Oh, no, you did not. Oh, she's going big spender with all of her meter there. Use her trait level three and all of her meter to do that super. Too bad you must die. We're going to do a little bit of this. And then we're going to... Oh. Oh. Oh, my... Off the dome! What was that, like, all my meter, though? I don't know how uh, good that combo uh, combo was. Let's see if I do... Oh? Oh? Oh, man. Oh, this is going to be sick, learning this character. I know it. I can feel it in my loins. hey -ya! Oh, she was going to do that wager. I just realized that she didn't wager yet, so we got to wait. Drop that combo real quick. And then do that one hit and finish the job. Good job, Scarecrow. Oh, we got some more gear for the Flash. Wait, what the? We did get some new Scarecrow legs. Equipped. Victor Stone, always online. 
I'm not afraid of information overload. You fear being disconnected. Hey, you fear uh, you run out of juice. You fear there's a power outage. Aye, okay. Oh, that, oh, I see that move a lot too. That had some good range. It's a, it's a great poking tool. Look at that. Oh, 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 oh. Nope, too far. Aye, okay. I wonder if any of you guys are uh, going to dress up as Scarecrow for Halloween. Eh? Me? I don't really have plans on dressing up uh, as anything this year. Um, Halloween was never one of my favorite holidays. Uh, October, the month of October in general, I'm not a huge fan. I love fall. All right, I love the leaves changing and all that. But uh, your boy is the biggest uh, wimp in the world. Like I can't do scary movies for the life of me. All right, I can't do them. Video games, scary video games. Okay, maybe, but movies. Oh man, if you guys can name the uh, the least scariest movie in the comments. i probably terrified of that, alright? But hey, I know when to give some respects to those horror icon characters like Jason, Michael Myers, Freddy Krueger, like I got them, alright? They cool, they cool. But just, I don't, I don't like watching the movies. I like knowing about the characters, if that makes any sense. Alright, I'm weird, man, I'm weird. Selena Kyle knows no fear. Not when it comes to you, Scarecrow. What if it comes to losing Bruce? Dang, dude, Scarecrow over here. Touching all the nerves. Woo! I think uh, I see people do a wake up with that all the time, right? What's that poke thing again? Four, two, yeah. Uh, uh. No. Oh, that works, kind of. Ah. Uh. He has a command grab as well. The the one that looks very painful and they make uh, the opponent do is like splits. How do I do that one? Nope, not that one. I think it's this. Wait, land eight heavy attacks. Let me let me get this challenge real quick. You know what I'm saying? I believe you can meter burn that, right? Okay, okay. If, if Catwoman wins this, I'm in a little in troubles. I'm in a little in troubles. Okay, okay. One more. Hear me roar. I get it, girl. I get it. There we go. And now we can do some damage. Oh, nice main tranks. Nice main tranks. Too bad you must die. <laughs> Scientists, you and I. You have no insights to share. I shall teach you fear. Ooh, see, Scarecrow is the best teacher on t uh, teaching fear, next to Sinestro. I, I. Oh man, I thought that would work. Hulk. I love that move. You know, another reason why I want to learn Scarecrow... Oh my goodness, that almost did 500 damage. Uh, what's his gear? I saw Scarecrow's gear, and he has some of the sickest gear in the game. Ooh Off the dome, boys. Off the... Oh my. hey -ya! Okay. So yeah, I'm hoping to unlock some sick gear. Maybe if we get good enough with this character. We can go online rank. Who knows? Who knows? Currently, I don't. Oh wait, I didn't even use this trait. Okay, okay. What, what do we got here? Take that. Take that extra damage. Uh, uh, uh. Okay, what do we got? Oh no. Pop. Nah, B! You try to summon your giant metal tentacles? Not on my watch! Not wearing a watch. Okay. For our first time playing Scarecrow, I got a couple basic uh, ideas of what I want to do for the combinations. Also, I watch a lot of tournaments, so I see what they do. And I'm like, okay, I probably can't do half the things they do, but I'll try to do <laughs> uh, part of it. But alright, let's see what Scarecrow's ending has to offer. After studying Brainiac's blood, I tweaked my fear toxin to exploit 
his alien biology. And as I gained control of his shattered mind, I also gained control of his ship. I began to explore Brainiac's enormous collection, soon realizing it was an unprecedented opportunity for study. Billions of species from millions of worlds, each with its own phobias and fears. Now, the Skull Ship is my laboratory. As it glides through the vast darkness of space, its collected beings are subjected to their worst nightmares. With each I study, my knowledge grows. It may take decades, but I will become the universe's greatest master of fear. Scarecrow just going above and beyond right there. He's like, nah, I don't want to scare one person. I want to scare the whole universe. Dang, okay, okay, not bad of an ending there. But that is the end of this first episode of season two, if you will, of Scarecrow's Boot Camp. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys did, give the video a thumbs up and comment down below and let me know. What is the least scariest movie out there that you know? I know some of you guys are like hardcore uh, horror film aficionados and you guys don't get scared easily. Just think of it as a child's perspective. What is the least scariest movie you know? Leave it down below and I maybe will check it out this Halloween. I don't know, okay? If I feel uh, uh, brave enough, I might watch it. But let me know all your thoughts down below. I hope you guys enjoyed the return of the boot camp with Scarecrow. Stay tuned for the next episode where we go in training and learn some spicy Scarecrow combos. But anyways, like, subscribe to the channel if you guys are new. Mine's on Cage Games and you just got caged. <laughs>